This is going to be the next game. Okay, I am looking for. Um, I'm looking for a word. It's, it's a food, by the way. Um, you snake this answer. Um, can you have a look? Do you have any idea what it might be? Um, well, you can have a look at it again in a minute. That's the next game. Ba bang, goodbye, go go. Uh, this lady's also coming up shortly. Her name is Kate Borsay, and she is carrying my pencil case. Uh, but she's having a baby. This lady is having a baby, and she's coming up very very soon. Um... Ooh. She doesn't know whether she... I, don't, I don't think she knows whether she's having a boy or a girl. I'm not too sure. Um, but Kate will be coming up soon. Um, what are you having? Oh, we're having a girl. We're having a girl. OK, nice. I'm going to be handing you over to Kate Borsay in just a moment. Um, I'm, I'm going to stand up for this. I'm going to stand up for this last caller. OK, stand up. Come over here. Um, Kate's not in the studio at the moment, so I won't hand over to, you, won't hand over to her just yet. Uh, but this will be... My, stop, the, stop the music for a second, please. Stop the music. Um, this will be my last caller before I do hand you over to Kate. Treat her well, please, because she's eating and drinking for two at the moment. Um, my last caller, letters, words or both that go before land, all right? Um, it, it's a familiar answer. I don't know what it is. Um, I, I'm just being told that... Um, OK. I'm just being told that you may... You may kick yourself um, when you see what this answer is. What is the answer? Yes, they will kick themselves. Um, it's, it's, it is familiar. It's, it is familiar. Um, I, oh, I know the answer. OK, give me some music. Give me some music, please. Give me some music. You know what? If, if, this, if the next caller does not... OK, does not give me the correct answer, perhaps... Perhaps... I will ask Kate to do this. Kate. OK, she knows, what she, she knows what she might just do. OK, I know what the answer is. £30,500, 500 quid guaranteed if you match that answer. Uh, do remember, I say this all the time, uh, I like to repeat stuff to you. Um, it is £1 to call me from a BT landline. Other networks, they may charge you more. Mobiles will cost considerably more. Please set yourself a limit and stick to it, as all calls are charged, whether you're selected to come through to me here in the studio or not. I take calls randomly from people on hold when the phone in the studio rings. There's an alternative entry to quizcall.co.uk. There you can see our terms and conditions and our fair entry policy. Make sure you're over 18, have Bill Pairs permission, and if you want our T's and C's in writing, write to the address at the bottom of the screen. It could be Remember Swedish. It could be something that, that vegetarians don't like, shaped. In a, in a, like a, a, a ball or something. Uh, hello, who's on the line? Marie. Hello, you're my last caller before Kate comes on. Uh, what's your answer? Timberland. Timberland. All right, the very best of luck to you. It is the wrong answer. I have given away over £6,000. There will be a brand new game starting soon, but you need to get rid of that. And I'm telling you, when you see it, you'll go, oh, my goodness. Uh, here's Kate Borsay. Have a great weekend. I've been Chris, and I will be here next week too. Kate! Thanks, Christopher the Daddy, Roxford. Uh, OK, now, we are going to clue the final answer on the game because we want to get moving. Uh, we've got another game to go to immediately and then we've got a main game to move on to after that. So, it's worth 150 quid. It's going to be a clue. We're going to make it nice and straightforward for you. Uh, that is what we're looking for. OK, starts with them. There's two letters after it and there's a land after it. I think I know what it is. And I can't believe you haven't got it yet. You just must have missed it for some random reason. Uh, it is, and it was classed as a familiar answer. So remember, it's nothing too complicated. M something something land on with our game. Here we go. Hello, who's there? Hi, it's Sarah. Sarah, now you very astutely are going to use the clue, are you? I hope so. OK, and what's your answer? <laughs> I'm hoping it's Midland, M-I-D. Before I tell you whether you're right or wrong, can you believe that no-one's got this yet? I know, it's easy enough. It's crazy, isn't it? Often, the easiest ones are the ones you miss. Uh, it is correct, though, Sarah. Congratulations. Oh, that's brilliant. Uh, hey, listen, there's a £10,000 jackpot. 
There's Mid MID. There's a £10,000 jackpot in play as well, darling, so come with me and play it. The 150 okay. is yours, guaranteed, okay, Sarah? Okay. Whereabouts are you in Wales, Sarah? Okay. April? Okay. We are, oh gosh, going up to the 20s. We've got 23rd of May. Never mind, you've got the 150, Sarah. That is Thank yours. You Congratulations. Down the line, darling. Well done. Sarah in Swansea has just won herself £150. Now, as promised, uh, have a look at our new game. Now, this one will not be on for very long. OK, guys, take a little look at this. Uh, this one won't be on for very long. A-T-S-E-B-L-M-A-L. All together makes a food of some sort, OK? makes a food of some sort. You start at one point, either the four corners or in the middle, and you unsnake the letters to form the words. So a bit like you find snake words in our words, so she should be very used to this. Mid was a snake. You start and you move at right angles, up, down, or across. You might want to start with the letter M. I think most of you will get it anyway. But I'm telling you now, you might want to start with the letter M. Do you know what's really nice at the beginning of the show for my first two callers, and I'm trusting you're going to get this right if you're my next caller, my first two callers to be winners. How lovely is that? What a great start to the second half of the show. If you are getting involved, you need to know it will cost you a pound from a BT landline. That could be more if you're calling from another network. It will be considerably more if you are calling from a mobile phone. Now, all calls are charged, whether or not you're selected to come through. On air callers, you're selected at random from those who are on the line at the time the phone in the studio rings. Don't forget you've got this alternative form of entry as well. That's via the web at quizcall.co.uk. Set yourself a daily limit and stick to it. You've got to be 18 or over. You've got to have the bill payers' permission and full terms and conditions of your fair entry policy. Up on the web, that's quizcall.co.uk or available from the address below. Uh, good evening, quiz callers. It's Friday night. We're moving into the weekend now nicely. Uh, this is the food, by the way. You unsnake the letters to come up with the name of the food. Uh, coming up very shortly, you'll get a preview of our next game. This will be on air. This one uh, will be on screen for not that much longer. I have to tell you, it's meant to be just a quick game, just to basically fill in whilst we get the next main game ready, because um, we don't sort of just produce graphic games. So you know you're a contender if you're on the line at any point between now and the phone ringing. There's that phone, remember, it could ring at any time. There's no clock on this game. And I reckon it's got to ring soon. We guaranteed to take regular calls here on the show. We can't keep you waiting too long for another phone, phone call for the phone to ring. So it's a food, it's a snake word. You start in either the four corners or in the middle to make your word. Here we go. Hello, who's there? Hey, how's it going on? Hello, sweetheart. Welcome to the show. Now, do you, do you think you know the answer? Yeah. And your name's Donna, is it? Yeah. All right, darling. Far away. What do you think it is? Meatballs. Meatballs? You're correct. Do you like meatballs, Donna? Yeah. <laughs> You'd have to say that, wouldn't you, really? You like yeah. me now, they won you 100 quid. Let's go play the jackpot with you, darling. So there's a £10,000 jackpot in play with that one. Now, if you saw Sarah from Swansea play this, you know, just give me a date of birth and I'm going to spin the wheels. If we match your date of birth with those wheels, uh, we're going to give you an extra £10,000. So some big cash up for grabs, potentially. Um, right, Donna, this is to add to yeah. your 100. What's your date of birth? The 6th of November. The 6th of November. Good luck. We've got an August, I'm afraid. August the 29th. Uh, Donna, never mind, you've still got your 100 quid. Well done for that. You can be uh, expecting that fairly soon through your door. Well done, Donna. Stay on the line for me, all right? 